Just be yourself, bro, is what I would say if I didn't ever want you to amount to anything in your life. Now, there are three types of people that will tell you this. Now, there's the first type, which they think they're saying the right thing. They truly believe that they are helping you and they truly believe in just being yourself because they have also had people telling them the same thing. Now, the next person is the type of person that will tell you this because they've heard somebody else say it and it is seen as an acceptable thing to say to people to make them feel like you care about them or their problems. You have to understand something. Nine out of 10 people don't give a fuck about you or your problems. It's not necessarily their fault, it's just how we are as humans. A lot of human beings are way too self-centered and care about themselves too much to care about you and your problems. And now you've got the last person and the last person will tell you this because they are the bottom of the barrel crab. They don't want you to succeed. They don't want you to do better. They don't want you to achieve things in your life. They don't want you to achieve success. They want to keep you down. They want to keep you where they are in life. And they use that as an excuse because again, it's seen as something that's socially acceptable to say to people. Oh, just be yourself, bro. Like, what, you're having girl issues? What, what your girl's not texting you back? What, you don't know what to say to her? Just be yourself, bro. Just be yourself. Well, you're not happy with where you are in life right now? Like, why not? Just be yourself. Bro, just crack open that can of beer, bro. Just, just smoke this spliff, man. Just be yourself, bro. Fuck that. Now, I'm not saying to try and be somebody different. I'm not saying to, to fake it. I'm not saying to just put up a persona that, you, that isn't truly who you are. But don't fall for the lies of just being yourself. If you're on self-improvement, if you're watching self-improvement content, it's because you want to better your life. You want to better yourself. You want to self-improve. You want to improve yourself. And that is you just being yourself. A part of you wants to level up. A part of you wants to be yourself, but a better version of yourself. I honestly think that just being yourself is an excuse. People use it as an excuse to do fuck all. People use it as an excuse to not go to the gym. Oh, I'm just, I just can't be asked to go to the gym, so I'm just gonna be myself and I'm just gonna sit and play video games instead and I'm not gonna level up in life. It is an excuse, bro. At the end of the day, it's an excuse. It's horrible, horrible advice and you shouldn't listen to it. And now again, this doesn't mean to try and be somebody you're not. This doesn't mean to just fake your personality. When you hear those words and when people tell you this, bro, it's seen as like a get out of jail free card. It's seen as something like, oh, do you know what? Yeah, I'm just being myself. I don't, I don't wanna go to the gym. I don't, I don't wanna level up. I don't wanna meditate. So I'll just be myself and I'll just do the bad habits instead. Just being yourself is always gonna lead to you doing something comfortable, doing something that you don't wanna do. And as men, we grow from discomfort. Just ask yourself this question, where has just being yourself got you so far in life? Because I know where it got me, fucking nowhere. It wasn't until I started leveling up, it wasn't until I started to get onto self-improvement that I've actually seen some sort of progress in my life, that I've actually started to work towards goals and I'm actually ambitious now, and I actually have a purpose now. It wasn't until I just stopped doing these bad habits, just stopped being myself, that I started to get somewhere in life. Please don't fall for the trap of just being yourself, bro. It is nothing but an excuse. Of course, always stay true to who you are, always stay true to your beliefs, but on the flip side to that, have some self-awareness and realize that if you want certain things out of life, you have to do certain things in order to get those things out of life. If you want to level up, you have to start doing something different. You have to stop being yourself for a little while because only then can you level up and start being a better version of yourself. You know, I talk a lot about mindset and I believe like all of this comes down to your mindset, bro. And if you have the mindset of, of just being yourself, how can you, how can you level up? How can you get to the next stage in life? Because again, like being yourself, just being yourself hasn't really got you that far, has it? If you really think about it and you're really honest with yourself, you don't grow as a person from just being yourself. You grow as a person from putting yourself out of your comfort zone and doing different things and doing things that your normal self wouldn't usually do. Bro, I wouldn't have started going to the gym if I was just being myself. If I was just being myself, I'd be sat at home smoking weed because that was, that was enjoyable because I thought that was the, the right thing to do for myself. But little did I know the gym was gonna take me down this path of self-improvement. Little did I know the gym was gonna change my life. It wasn't comfortable the first time that I walked into the gym. It wasn't comfortable the first time I picked up those dumbbells and started pressing them. 
But I grew from that discomfort. It all connects, bro. It all it all interlinks. Like all these small things that you do to level up in life, they all connect to each other. One thing leads to another. The gym can lead to you starting a business. The, the business can lead to you getting a girlfriend. The girlfriend can lead to you getting a family. And then it all interlinks, bro. All these small little steps that you take in life to better yourself will get you a lot further than you sitting there just being yourself. And obviously it all depends on what context you put it in, but but I believe my words resonate with a lot of young men and I believe that you probably have the same sort of mindset when it comes to, to this saying, when it comes to people telling you to just be yourself. You have untapped potential, bro, and if you're on self-improvement, you know that, you realise that, and you are on the right path to unlocking your potential. You are on the right track to getting somewhere in life. You are on the right track to success. Just being yourself will stop you from reaching that potential. Watch this video right here to help you on your self-improvement journey. I appreciate you if you watch to the end. Like, share, comment and subscribe if you're new. I'm making it my mission to help turn boys into men.